Hello everyone, Bon Yuki here with another video and today I'm going to be talking about the Mister and its line 6 out capability. A lot of people talking about this 6x resolution mode on the RetroTINK 5x and it is pretty impressive and it's nice that the Mister has that ability as well. So right here as you can see I'm kicking out a 1920 by 1440p mode. I believe that's mode 12 in the I&I. &I. And it works surprisingly well and it looks clean and this is going to be only for those 4k users out there and this is a 75 inch uh, TCL mini LED and as you can see here it looks pretty decent. So right now I'm going to load up a game that I know how it looks. I'm going to see the resolution switch and the reason why you're seeing a resolution switch is because after speaking to certain people on the Geotaco forums um, they have said hey why mess around with these resolutions in 5x cropping when you could just do higher resolution? So right now you're seeing a 1920 by 1344 image and just putting, you know, little things like this on there. Uh, now the scan lines match up perfectly well. You get the full image. It's in high resolution and it looks crisp. It looks wonderful. Believe me, folks, the camera that I have is a GoPro Hero 8. It cannot capture how marvelous this looks. I, I, I mean, I'm not gonna say it's sitting there better than a CRT, but now that with the scan lines matching up and the aspect ratios being the way it's supposed to be due to A-Track 17's uh, hard work, I'm gonna put a link to his Patreon as well because that guy definitely, I, I mean, I tried messing around with this a, a while ago and it took me quite a long time just to get a couple of cores working. He's pretty much done a lot of them. So this looks pretty wonderful. Let me turn this down a little bit. But it looks very, very crisp, very, very good. And he's done it for most of the cores out there. So this obviously is CPS2. But let's let's try something that um you know more people know. We'll do a little um how about some oh I don't know. We'll do uh Sega Genesis. There we go. Something that's a little bit more more common for everyone but um yeah he put down custom custom reses for all these cores and it's very very impressive uh i've been playing around with them for a little bit earlier today and i must say that this guy definitely dialed in the settings and i'm impressed so i joined his patreon right off the bat to show support to those out there and pretty pretty swell dude helping us out and you know you don't have to donate but I'm, I definitely wanted to. So that resolution right now is a 1920 by 1344. And you'll see a, a, that it's just looking sweet on this. I mean, it looks great. Let me go over to my scanning. And I put a little contract boost in there because it makes the, um, it makes the, whatchamacallits, the, it makes the scan lines look a lot better. And I usually go to a 40% sharp. And it looks solid. It looks great. So, you know, it's looking good here. Let me go to another core. Uh, something you guys might know as well. Let's try uh, Nintendo. Let's see what resolution is kicked out with these 6X modes for Nintendo now. And my TV likes these screens. I mean, right now it's 1792 by 1440. So let's pick a game that... Uh, most people will know about one of my favorites here. Let's do Gimmick. Very good Sunsoft game. 1792 by 1440, line 6x, looks excellent. I'll give it a little gamma boost correction. Because on this, on this TV, you, I need a little contrast boost on it. I mean, it's mini LED and, and sometimes some of the colors wash out with the scan lines. But yeah, look at that. The scan lines are looking even. They look great. Oh, what palette is this? Smooth? Yeah, I like th this one. Sony CXA. Um, yeah, and it looks solid. So 6X is definitely doable on the Mister. Um, I think it varies TV per TV. So you'll have to look and see, does my TV support this? Um, this is just a TCL 6 series from last year. Doesn't have a problem doing the 6X. And then, like I said, the, the scan lines line up like they're supposed to, which is great. That's one thing, um, the 5X normally 
doesn't line up with the scan lines normally. If you use the crop offset, that new mode that they came out with, which basically kicked the lines up and down off a little bit on the overscan, that does make the scan lines line up on these on this screen. And it looks fine, but you are cutting off information. Most of the times games don't need it, but ar arcade games definitely do. But this is a nice workaround, or in my opinion, it's a sol straight up solution. Just play the games in 6X and you get everything looking right. You get everything lined up and you get that higher image. And it looks, it looks pretty great. I mean, the gimmick probably never looked better on this screen. So it's just a PSA out there. I'll send links to his uh, Patreon and to his GitHub as well. That's why you can just go there, take a look at it. I mean, it was just a simple um, drop in and Mr. I and I. I made some changes to like my analog out, but other than that, it was just drag and drop and you can have this running. Like I said, try it on your screen. It might not be compatible with all screens. These are very obtuse resolutions. Like, uh, what was this again? This was, yeah, 1792 by 1440. This TV seems to like all these resolutions. It's very bizarre. This TCL, I mean, I would I could send it mode lines that are made for, you know, that screen and, and 120 hertz and stuff and this this tcl just seems to eat it and just take it i mean it's it doesn't really care um i don't know it's just very diverse chip they have in there which is a bit odd because tcl is known to be like a lesser brand than say uh samsung or a sony or an oled uh an lg oled so but it, it just it just likes them it just takes any resolution so for um its compatibility i i give it high marks i mean it's one of the screens I use for gaming, and uh, there's no burning because it's a mini LED. I mean, let me see. Let me let me try out Super Graphics. I haven't tried out this. Uh, let me see how Dive Mic. I don't even have it on here. I thought I had that game. I guess not. I don't have any Super Graphics games. Or oh, maybe I have to change the extension or something. Uh, let's try. What's a game? Oh, we'll try Bonk's Adventure. That's a nice, quick game. Goes right into the. Um, to the gameplay right after and you see bonk he's dancing or he's like laying down and um no bonk's an okay game it's um they're wannabe mascot that hudson soft was putting out there back in uh i want to say you know right in the late 80s early 90s it's a it's an all right game you can i think this game got ported over to the platform to like super nintendo but this looks very very crisp um let me see what the contrast boost is because no that's that's right and scan lines look good Game looks great, and uh, res the, the aspect ratio is fine. So what you'll see in the I and I is you'll see the custom resolution and the custom aspect ratio, and it looks pretty phenomenal, breathtaking. So um, yeah, 6X, definitely doable on Mr. FPGA, and it looks great. So you guys go out there and give it a shot, and let me know how it goes. Thank you.